I'm here with the ladies from the Agro Women Organization in Shady Spring White Houses. Welcome my wonderful viewers and subscribers. Today I'm out by Shady Spring out by White Houses where I'll be meeting up with some young ladies that will be starting a project Agro Woman Farm out by White Houses. So I'm there now trying so. to get to them. You see, no spot going on. Come on, late. I want you to walk on the sidewalk. It's past this already, so probably here, so you leave some trail, some truck. Tr truck, trail, truck. A uh, truck trail. <laughs> so I'm going to follow it still and see where I go. Anyway, exactly still, but check out the, the farm, the female agro, fa agro farm up a uh, shady spring. It's supposed to reach from mine, but you know, go somewhere else. But through my promise, I'm gonna come. I'm taking a trail. Yes, people. So, this is it. So, we can find my way. And guess what? Phone up, pick up. I didn't place here, you know. No phone pick up, I didn't place here. So, might last something's okay anybody home bird and tree I don't know which way to go from here so truly I see nowhere this ear so it's the right place. What may I try to Alright. Jam! Jam jam! Yeah, I can't put me in a body. My viewers and my subscribers, welcome, welcome. You know, today um, I was invited to a little female farm up in a Shady Spring, up in the White Houses area. So they invited us to come and take a look on what they are doing actually. Actually, they are just starting up the farm right now. So I'm just going to see what exactly is taking place. So follow me on on the journey. See it? I hear somebody, people. Me like one the female voice, so I say, me can't. Ah, oh. me see. We're truck, we're truck. To the right. All right. So, to follow the truck. So, we follow the truck. And so, so people see it a woodland but it can't turn up on a trail it's so all gone yes see it here woodland plant up a woodland ah see the fire and them that see so ah fire burning but keep it on say the fireman I pass through yes So this is where they are now, people. My viewers and my subscribers. Young female, trained them thing. You understand? They're not itch for the thing. They're not itch for it. When you put one cell to up here, so phone can pick up, up here, so no. I think I'm going to go to the I'm going to go to the I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go to the 
Yeah, what this side is on, or something. How much acre? How much, how much acre? How much acre? How big is the farm? We have access to a couple of acres as well, but by the time of clean, it's a farm. Yeah. Okay. And the time we don't clear what we want, it's about a half. One and a half acre. Yeah, but we're sure oh. we have more than that. We don't have acres here. Yeah. I don't know. 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 It's got uh, all the way to the it's like a drum tree right up there, so you know. So we start from the tree there, so go back. You don't think that's a little bit? And then we'll go eat us too. It's about one acre. If we get irrigation water system. Yeah, all of that in the making. Okay. That's me the fun thing. And the stream is there where we will um, be pumping water oh, from. Says, the stream is on that side. Yeah. Oh, it's on that side. So, so when, the, and we have the main pipe. Eh? Yeah. Alright, let's see if we can take a walk with you to where the pipe, the, the river, the river or spring is on that side. So these are the ladies of the farm. Oh. Let me see if we can um, zoom in. And, um, so the stream oh, the right oh, there is about Let's see if we can zoom in. Alright. And the letter. Let's see if I can see the name. Hold on. Let's, let's zoom in. Let's see. Oh, I see the pet in there. See the weapon, it's, 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 that's the mirror out there. Carefully, the oh, yeah, yeah, water, it's spring water, yeah. Right at the end, this is the end of the land, that's the big um, tree right here. Oh. That's the end of the land. So the stream is just right stream below. Stream just below, oh. Yeah, so make sure so, when you come. So you get irrigation water up here. Mm -hmm. So people, so my viewers and my subscriber, remember, these are young female trying to make a difference in St. Thomas, in Jamaica, in the world. So you can go out and support them. They have a GoFundMe because they're starting up so they would like some equipment and so forth. So you can help them, right? So I will be posting the link for the GoFundMe in the description. Uh, so you can subscribe to Life with Little Gem because she will be posting on her channel, YouTube channel, um, yeah. what taking place wow. up the farm. So see them on here clearing up. Yes, guys, Shoshana McKenzie here on the farm grounds of Agua Women Foundation. My team member over there, Miss Ramsey. I am marketing director of Agro Women's Foundation Limited. We are doing some cleanup work here on the farmland. We're doing some cleanup work. If you look over there, you can see where we have the fire. We're burning the trashes, gathering the wood to pack for coal burning. And over to that end, we will be having a campsite. So yes, people, we will be doing camping, agro tourism, eco-tourism and community tourism we are in shady spring white horse is st thomas more will be revealed to you guys as we develop but this is just where we are at for now so again this is my team member miss ramsey you have anything you want to say to them miss ramsey i'm not really prepared for anything but you had to tell it all um in brief that um this foundation is based on um, empowering women and youths. We tend to do that to train, um, to farm training, and to assist with grants. So, like those are just long-term goals. Long-term goals. 
with the training but for now we are basically focusing on farming and the eco cabin for to attract tourism for tourism purpose yes guys so that's the campsite initiative i was just telling you guys about we we will be having um, a project it's called camp farm jamaica so ecotourism community tourism and agrotourism where you will be able to come and camp on the farm participate in farming activities we have lots of acres of land that you will be able to hike go bird watching um, you will have ocean views because it goes way back up in the hills right yes so when they are up there they will be able to see beautiful horizons so yes, like this scenery. <laughs> awesome scenery. This is what we have accomplished thus far. We will be fencing soon and we will be building the campsite very soon. So it's a lot of work guys and we are in it to win it. We also have started a campaign for donations. So donations are welcome. The link will be in the description of this video. So you can go over there and donate. Whatever you have, it's welcomed. Thank you, guys. Question: So, how many? I only see, um, two persons here right now. Mm -hmm. So, how many persons really involved in this venture? All right. Con currently, we have seven professional women, which include ourselves. Um, you have met one other. That's um, Sashana um, Patterson, the last Mackenzie. female that was here last time. Yeah. We had the link up. Yes and so we have as i said before seven and we are including in that amount all professional women covered with their own uh, specific uh, areas of expertise yeah. mm -hmm. yes so um seven board members yes. so you are young people trying to make a difference in right that's that's community. that's how it is yes, yes. All right. in the parish of saint thomas okay so you're from white houses area i am i am not originally but grow um i think i came to white horses when i was about um six six years or probably a little earlier yes yes and you are and early. i am from license originally yes so how long since you start this project this project was <laughs> it's a long story but um, I had the, uh, the whole vision of, I'm a person that loves children and I did early childhood um, training to the art trust and from that time till now I'm interested in doing a daycare setup, so an early childhood um, kind of settings and I had write a proposal before um, and submitted to the Canadian government which for grants to do for grant to, to do a um, daycare facility and um, we I did that grant was approved but I didn't receive the funding based on the fact that I was just an individual individual sorry <laughs> individual okay. and um, they said oh we have if I'm to do something like that it would have to be it have to be done on the community body and when I approach my community um, fellow men and women the, that's the White Horses Benevolent Society. It wasn't structured enough to actually have them even um, give us the grant to the um, foundation. So with with all that, now 2024, uh, 2023, we, I have my friends, we have the same aim and objective and to the old farming idea, we tend to give it a mix um that not just to do the farming only but to actually blend the whole of uh, the community join in as well with the um early childhood helping the women and and um kids. and all the early childhood that actually come in play is that for the single mothers we are aiming to assist them with an area um to facilitate the our child care for the children during the days for children mostly who don't attend school babies then kind of daycare presetting. You never tell me how long you start this um agro farming. Physically about one. Okay. including the clear up? Yes, right? yes, you're right. 
Um, we yes, about a month, three weeks now. Okay. We have been doing um. We had cut the road. The tractor came and did the road cutting, and we had some poor men too that um come to do a, just a week work, and now we are doing the burning now. So it's an additional week. So do you put this proposal, um, uh, put a proposal to RADA? Um, yes, we have our extension officer working with currently, which we should be updating as we go along. And RADA will be coming in to assist us with flowing yes. the land. So that has been arranged. So part of the cleanup work, they will be here. So do you have, uh, can you give an idea of the products? Uh, produce that you were producing. All right, um, of... quick crops. All right, <laughs> definitely right. quick crops. Yes, mainly quick crops, and that will include um, peppers, um, sweet potato, um, Irish. I think we'll do Irish. They said Irish need a lot of water, <laughs> but you know, during the time of year, we'll actually have to change what we intend to. Farm at that time. Watermelon, pumpkins, yes, stuff like that. Okra. Yes, okra, most mm. definitely. Because mm. the market is there for okra. Uh, it, it is um, Agro Women Foundation, Foundation. Limited. Limited, right. Yes. So, what if males want to come in and help assist or be a part of your organization? Will they be able to? be a part of it yes there's space for everyone but not to be on our board but the work is definitely here as you can see we have males working on our clearing up and <laughs> doing the clearing up work definitely um, um male for is needed most of okay. can't do without the males can't do without the males <laughs> <laughs> i know that so do you have anything to say to uh, other young lady out there um in brief, um, whatever idea you have and you think that, well, because of money or you, you don't have money to start this, you don't have money to do this, you don't have the help, you don't have anyone to monitor or to, to guide you throughout, I will say don't think that because it starts with you, you understand, your idea putting it on paper and suggesting it saying to say to somebody not just somebody who that cannot assist you know to say to somebody who you know all right for instance me in want to do farming and i go to rada and say i'm interested in to do farming but i want to do it at this level and someone from rada could say yes it's a good idea but here this is where you need to start and there are a lot of foundation out there as well ready to do funding this is 2024 going on onwards there are a lot of foundation there there are a lot of um international agencies bodies ready to fund small projects very small projects and it it doesn't you don't have to give anything you just state your idea display and know that you're committed and ready to do this if you can't do it an, as an individual person, get some other persons, seek their out there for other persons that are that have the same um, aim and objectives or ideas ideas and you can do it. Okay, thank you. Well said, well said. Okay. Do you have anything to say to other young ladies out there? Well I would say um, young people, not just young ladies, young Whatever you put your mind to, you can do it. Because my philosophy is anything I want to do, I will get it done. Just believe in yourself and you will accomplish whatever you set yourself out to do. And do everything with the guidance of the Most High. Talk to God about everything that you plan to do and seek guidance and He will lead you. And yeah, just believe in yourself. All right, thank you. I'm here with the ladies from the Agro Women Organization in Shady Spring White Tarses. Houses. All right. right, so people, these are young women trying to make a difference in the world 
in Jamaica and the world and in the parish, right? So they're calling on other women to be a part of this organization or other organization and get themselves in line, get themselves out of trouble. Agree with me? Yes, get involved. Get active. <laughs> yes. So you can follow our social media handles on Instagram at Agro Women Foundation Limited. That's Agro Women LTD on Instagram and Camp Farm Jamaica for the camping project. It's Camp Farm JA on Instagram and my YouTube channel. I will be posting updates, updated video content on the project and what's happening. My YouTube handle is Life with Little Gem. It will be mentioned in this video description so you can check it out subscribe and follow the journey and welcome to the agro women foundation limited family and camp farm ja so i just stopped by the agro women foundation start of farm project so i'm going back out now so, you know, after support, everything that's taking place in St. Thomas, show the development, show everything, what the young people are into, positive elements that they're into. So, so this is, they clearing up the land now to start their farming 